Within the United States, one of the many beautiful geologic wonders in the western section of the country is Meteor Crater in Arizona. This impact crater is the single best preserved crater on the entire planet. When it formed 50,000 years ago, megafauna such as woolly mammoths and car-sized armadillo-like creatures known as glyptodons were among its victims. However, this is not the only large impact crater within the country. Another large impact crater is located in a place many people would not expect, Iowa. This several million year old large crater went undiscovered until 1959 since it has been buried by more than 100 feet of sediment. Once revealed, it was measured at 22 miles or 35 kilometers wide and 2800 feet deep. It formed during a catastrophic impact event which still affects the area's water table to this day. This video will discuss this impact crater and the scope of the associated impact. Approximately 73.8 million years ago, the Earth was a much warmer planet. At the time, western Iowa was the site of a temperate inland sea which stretched from Texas to the Arctic. It contained numerous fish and giant reptile species such as the 30-foot long plesiosaur. Meanwhile, in the asteroid belt, a large asteroid made its final approach towards the planet. This asteroid measured 1.4 miles or 2.3 kilometers wide and was on a collision course with Earth. This asteroid was not particularly dense, which relates to its formation 4.5 billion years ago. In the early solar system, particles of rock the size of sand and cobbles merged together due to the force of gravity forming small asteroids. Although many of these asteroids went on to become larger bodies of rock such as planets and larger asteroids, others remained. Known as chondrites, these types of asteroids when viewed up close contain numerous small spheres of material clumped together. More than 85% of all meteorites which enter the Earth's atmosphere are chondrites. As this asteroid entered the upper atmosphere, it was traveling at 20 kilometers per second or 45,000 miles per hour. Only a few seconds later, this asteroid struck what is now western Iowa, generating a massive explosion equivalent in energy to the detonation of 1.1 million megatons of TNT. This created a massive fireball which vaporized a large section of the ocean and underlying limestone. It was so intense that it caused all plant and animal life within a 280 mile radius, aka all of Iowa, to ignite. As the associated shockwave expanded outwards, all trees in a 373 mile or 600 kilometer radius are flattened, pointing away from the explosion. As a large tsunami was created due to the impact, a magnitude 8.6 earthquake was generated. This was large enough to be felt more than 1,000 miles away in what is now Phoenix, Boise, and New York City. These areas soon received a dusting of ash. After the dust cleared, what remained was a 22 mile wide impact crater. Despite the proximity of this impact event to the eventual extinction of the non-avian dinosaurs, it did not cause any mass extinctions. Life soon after recovered, although the crater has left a permanent feature in the subsurface. The area surrounding the town of Manson in Iowa has unusually soft water which is void of minerals such as calcium and magnesium. This is strange as the rest of the state contains hard water. The reason for this is that the impact vaporized a large quantity of limestone. Since the limestone is not present in a small radius, it does not contaminate a section of the state's groundwater. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to request a specific topic, please leave a comment below. Additionally, if you would like to support this channel, consider becoming a patron on Patreon.